Everyone has a home, a place where you feel safe. And this is mine, a prison cell in a block A. You can ask, how did I end up here? You know, I was a simple journalist and dug in a wrong place. The mayor set me up. He said elections were coming soon and offered me money. Huh, it was tempting, but I refused and now I'm here in prison. 27 days until the elections. Will I be able to escape and deal with this dirty mayor? Well, my friend, everything will be in your hands in the game called Back to the Dawn. And this will be story Choices Matter Detective RPG, where you will have to somehow survive and even escape the prison. Sounds interesting, definitely it is, but will it be a good game? Ok, let's find out. The story I just told you will be a story of Fox Thomas, he is just a journalist who get into the trouble. But there also will be a story of Black Panther Bob, whose mission is to infiltrate the prison with a top secret mission. And something tells me that there will be one more story. So we have different characters and all these characters have different goals and different attributes. Fox Thomas is very weak, strength is only 3, not very good at agility, but he uses silver tone. And actually, I just find out that Bob is better in everything. But anyway, let's choose Thomas, cause I like his story. As you can see, there will be three different backgrounds, and all of those backgrounds will give you certain positive, negative and special abilities. Not a bad start, it feels like a true RPG gem. And believe it or not, but I was very impressed by RPG part of this game. So let me quickly show you. You will need stamina to perform certain actions. You will need focus to perform special actions. You will have health, you will have mind. You also, let's get up, will have excellent inventory, you will be able to equip items and different items will give you different bonuses. You also need to eat, drink, sleep, all that stuff. You will have attributes and of course friends, a special part will be your abilities. Your abilities will be connected to attributes and take a look. Each of these attributes will have different set of abilities. And even more, my friends, when you perform a certain action, you will get experience point. And experience will be different for each tree. So my charisma has only 5 experience point. But in agility I have 10 experience point. But I still need 100 to unlock a next ability. Isn't it amazing? But even more, you will have quest, main quest, gang related quest and side quest. And of course, my friends, you can join a gang. This is a prison, by the way. This gang don't like me, but this hmm, approves what I'm doing. And you will have relationship with all prisoners and there will be plenty of prisoners. My favorite one is this Warlos. And yep, this alpaca is also a very interesting character. A little bit crazy, but interesting nonetheless. But enough of this, let's go straight to the combat. I was just walking a prison yard when decent sized crocodile, definitely a gang member, decided to take my money away. No chance, crocodile, I will not give you my money. So I decided to fight, combat started. And I enjoy this combat a lot, cause it will be drawn based, you will have health and stamina, you will be able to use different kind of items, weapons. Sometimes you will need to skip a throne and rest a while to restore some stamina. And of course you will be able to use a special moves. There will be even a status effects like bleeding or stunning. Well, what can I say friends, I enjoy this combat a lot. Maybe not that particular situation, I mean encounter cause it ended badly for me. But still combat looks amazing, if you love throne based combat, yep, you will like it. 
And yes, I lose all my money and plenty of health points, but not my pride, friends, not my pride. Life in prison never gonna be boring, so a simple quest to call my lawyer for help turned into the huge adventure. The phone was here, just in the main hall, but to call someone you need to pay ten dollars and ninety dollars service fee. <laughs> That's insane. Of course, there was not enough money in my pocket, so my first quest was to get some money to make a phone call. And I decide to work for government to behave myself good. I sign up for a work in laundry, but just before it you need to go to infirmary to a local doctor. And here I make a little romance with a nurse. Maybe she will help me to escape later in the game. Who knows? And with a doctor permission I finally get into laundry and try to do some laundry work. And it doesn't really work well. I fail almost all of mini games. And by the way, I like this mini game. They are really very unusual. Well, it's really hard to make a normal money with honest work here. So I decide to join again. Friends, I want to know my viewers better. So confess to me who of you was or maybe still a member of a gang. Drop me a comment. But let's continue. The gang member give me a quest. I need to set up one fellow. I need to put a very suspicious bag under his bed. Finally I found out his cell and eyes was everywhere. Silently I sneak in and try to do it. And by the way, any action you will perform will be closely connected to your attributes and abilities. Mine was very low, so I fail all five dice rolls in a row. And yep, everything will be decided by a dice roll. In the end, I lose all my focus and fail game quest. And you already know the ending of my story in the backyard, Crocodile take all my money away. Oh, so many adventures and it was only my first day in prison. And there will be so many things, other things you can do in prison. You can craft something, you can work for guards. Yeah, you will earn some points and you can spend those points for some services like additional phone call. You can share a half of your meal in a dining room to make a new friendship. And during all of this, don't forget to keep an eye on your health, I mean eating, sleeping, resting. Some quests will be time limited. Actually, many quests including your main quest, do you remember? You have to escape the prison. And you have only 21 day to do it. Well, what can I say? I enjoy Back to the Dawn a lot and I can recommend it with pure heart. If you like this setting, I mean life in the prison, you will definitely enjoy this game. With that said, thank you friends for watching and for me it's time to go back to my cell. God is coming soon. And don't forget, I will meet you tomorrow.